in this great year of faith uh, called by Pope Benedict. It's a great joy for me to be here to talk uh, about my faith as a personal journey. Faith is always a journey. It's not only something abstract. It's, uh, it's a life. Faith about meeting Jesus Christ. And I can say I had the privilege, the grace, it's a gift, a great gift of, uh, being, of having a, a Christian Catholic uh, youth and uh, with my parents uh, since uh, I cannot remember when it be I began to learn about uh, Jesus, hear about Jesus. So it's always been with me since my early, most early age as an infant. And uh, when I was from five to 10 years old, for instance, uh, in the family every, every day of the week in the, uh, in the early evening, we would pray the rosary together. And it's this, in a sense, it is still with me. So what I received in my, as I was a youngster I, is, is still with me as I was an infant, is still with me. Afterwards, in the adolescent period, I, I wanted to discover the world, uh, be open to the world discover the beauty in the world, but also the suffering in the world, and position myself, what, I, what do I want to do in that world, in this world, about beauty, about the beauty, how to serve beauty, but also how to be there at the same time for the poor. It's like a hand and on the beauty of the world and a hand on the suffering in the world. For me, it was about keeping the two together and serving people. And, uh, and I, would, I was looking in the different fields, different aspects, different studies, never really coming to, a, oh, that's what I want. I had never had that moment as an adolescent. I just wanted to do everything. So I went from one place to the other, uh, the Royal Military College for a couple of years, uh, Polytechnic, Ecole Polytechnic. I went also studying economics and politics, but without going to the, L, to the end of reaching a, a diploma. Uh, so uh, it was some time, it was with the joy uh, energy of you, of a young, uh, young man, but also, uh, also with some uh, pain and suffering as I uh, was looking for my way, uh, my, my path in the world. Uh, when I was 25 years old, around uh, Christmas uh, in 1976, uh, the desire to be priest began to be present into me, so I was a bit surprised at the beginning. How come I'm thinking about becoming a priest? I had faith, but I, I, ne I had never thought about being a priest. It was about Christian values and living those values in the world. But uh, how come I want to become a priest? And then, but this desire that was uh, beginning to surge into me was quite uh, powerful. So I told myself, okay, if in two months I'm still thinking about it, I'll go and see my uncle who's a priest in Quebec, father, uh, father of the Holy Sacrament. And uh, well, a couple of months later, it, uh, it faded away, but coming uh, Holy Week uh, 77, uh, it, it began anew. I began to think about becoming a priest, uh, giving myself to Jesus Christ, uh, uh, to pro announce, uh, proclaim His love, uh, the love of God to the world, and to consecrate my life to that mission, to that service. To, and it became important for me, the, the desire was great. There was the matter of being a celibate, because being called to be a priest was also being called to, to be a celibate. So I was thinking about it because I'd been, uh, my hope was for uh, marriage, my, uh, the hope of my youth was for marriage. And, uh, but at the same time, at one point I said to God, I don't know what you're doing when you're calling me to be a priest, a celibate priest, but uh, you know what you're doing, so, and I trust, uh, I trust in you. So that's how I answered. I went to, uh, to answer that call to become a priest, celibate priest in the world, to be consecrated to Jesus Christ and to make his love known uh, in the world. So it's been a trip uh, of faith, a pilgrimage of faith, and uh, I've never looked back. I'm, I'm very happy with that trip, very happy with that call, because it's really, we say faith, and uh, it's to meet Christ. But in that occasion, it was Christ who met me. And uh, I'm a blessed, I was blessed by his, uh, meeting him and believing in him and faith. Uh, so it was a reconciling uh, my uh, infancy and my adolescence, and the faith of my infancy and the desire of my adolescence to make the world a better place. So by, and here it's uh, starting from faith, by faith and faith, uh, proclaim the love of God to the world. So it's been a, a pathway, a pilgrimage of joy. And uh, I'm still happy to be there answering God's call and making God's love known into the world.